Financial Literacy for Kids, Part 6, Calculating Sales Tax. Have you ever heard of a sales tax before? Sales tax is a tax charged whenever a good or service is sold. The seller collects the tax on the good or service from the buyer and then gives it to the government. The government then uses the tax to pay for things like new roads, water lines, or even to pay your public school teacher. Today, we are going to learn more about sales tax and how to calculate it. This will help you become more financially literate, which means using certain skills to smartly manage money. But first, here is an interesting fact. The states of Delaware, Alaska, Montana, New Hampshire, and Oregon do not have a state sales tax. Now that we know what sales tax is, let's talk about how it is determined or calculated. Sales tax is calculated as a percentage of the purchase price of an item. And this rate changes depending on what state you live in and what item you are purchasing. Generally, sales tax ranges from about 4% to around 9%. And sometimes, depending on where you live, items like groceries and some prescription medications are exempt from sales tax. Make sense? Let's find our friend Frankie Finance and see if we can help her figure out how to calculate sales tax. Frankie has her heart set on buying a book that costs $5. But that is the cost of the book before sales tax. She has $6 total, so she wants to make sure that she has enough money to buy the book once sales tax is added to the purchase price. After some research, Frankie finds out that the sales tax for the book is 8.25%. First, she has to change the sales tax percentage to a decimal, like this. 8.25% equals 0 0.0825. Next, she needs to multiply the sales price of the book by 1 plus the decimal she just figured out. 1 plus 0 0.0825 equals 1.0825. So, she will need to multiply 5 with 1.0825. This equals 5.4125. Last, she needs to round the number to the nearest hundredth. This will give her the total cost of the book, which is $5.41. So, the sales tax on the $5 book equals 41 cents. Kind of a cool trick, right? And since Frankie has $6, she can afford to buy the book. What great news! Do you think you can try this at home? Do some research to figure out what the sales tax rate is where you live. With this information, you can figure out the sales tax on lots of different items. This will help you become more financially literate and is also something interesting you can share with your family and friends. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.